right, so. If I rapid deploy an engineer, I can have the engineer run over here, do this, start running over there. You might be able to get here with another command point. I don't know. Engineers have legs, sort of. Motherfucking Rita! This is an order. Requesting reinforcements. I need them sorted now. Angry. Here I go. All right. So what's so special about this thing that you need an engineer to engineer it, huh? Okay, get some distance and break that ice. Oh, no. Okay. For a second, I thought it was a two-stage operation. It's not. It worked. Splendidly done. Are you watching, Squad F? Perhaps we failed to destroy the Empire. But we shall defeat our true enemy. We will be victorious. Minerva, will you not give in? You not give in until you've achieved that particular objective? Everyone all right? All right. The good news is we can definitely run this in two, so that's nice. Here's the lines up. Okay, get some distance and break that ice. Do 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 do. All right. Now, for the love of God, hide over here, because Jesus, you could die in an instant. Good turn. So, now, we know that this tank is going to constantly come up this way, go down here, come up this way. It's just going to be caught in this loop. That's wonderful. Knowing that, we can punish it for existing. We need to start doing that by having the Edelweiss get the ever-loving fuck out of there and also potentially uh, start killing these things because there's a whole bunch of people here. It would be nice if we could take this point because this is the last point the enemies have and eventually they won't be able to spawn dudes. But that's a problem for future us. Ready to go. us has to cross in front of this death cannon and not get death cannoned. So please don't get death cannoned, Welkin. Please don't get death cannoned, Welkin. All right, say, while we're here, is there anything you can death cannon? Is it like left front turret? Yeah, sure, left front turret. Good job, Welks. Okay, uh, keep moving forward, why don't you? Ready to go. Uh, yeah, actually. Since we're here, let's just knock out that left front turret. Please don't miss. Hey, you didn't miss. Good. Okay, now, for the love of God, do not show the fucking dude your fucking glowing weak point. That's a bad fucking idea. And granted, there's a whole bunch of scouts and shock troopers over there that can also see your glowing weak point, but details. Speaking of details, I think I want Lily to run up this way. This might be how I get Lily killed, but I have an idea. My idea is Lily runs up here, Lily kills the Scott Trooper, Lily crouches here and bagnates herself. That might be a bit ambitious. Let's see. Here I go. Keep firing! Lily, isn't there a Shock Trooper right here? Ah, someone can see you! Let's see what fate has in store. Oh no, someone can see you! Lily, who can fucking see you? Oh. This. Okay. How unfortunate. Another one down. All right, you know what? Uh, the idea of Lily charging forward into the scout is actually a bad one, so Lily's gonna back off. Roger. That's it. Get yourself less fucked, would you? Great, great. This is amazing, actually. This right here? No, no. This right here. Okay. Oh, I had to. Mm, damn it. I didn't want you to. I wanted you to rag me back. Okay, okay, okay. I did. Burn, I did wind up wasting a command point, but it's okay. All right. Not the end of the world. It's okay. I think we're in a really. I think we're in a place. I think we know sort of what's going on a little bit. I think there's a lot of shit happening up that way. I think Lily might be dead, but only might, so there's that. Okay. All right. I suppose he can make new entry points to the ice for himself, can he? That would be mean if he could do that. I don't think he can do that. That seems a little bit much. How are the levels, by the way? Does it, does it sound okay? I don't know if it sounds good or not. I hate to think that I'm drowning in the mix this whole time, but... Okay, so this guy's behaving exactly the way I expected him to. Good. Good. 
Okay, got a death zone here. Welcome. Oh boy, I need to get an engineer over there. Stat. I'm not supposed to. Oh, you have a grenadier now? Oh, I'll suck it. Okay. That's not gonna really matter much. Okay. Okay. This is progressing. So, if the Edelweiss comes up here, I think I can drive through here. If I'm wrong, I have to go around. But the Edelweiss comes up here, takes out the Grenadier and this Shock Trooper, and probably this Shock Trooper. I can also run Rita over here to heal the Edelweiss, which will be amazing. Yes. Well, can you're fine. Well, can you're not fine. Yeah. Actually, Welkin, you're in a lot of trouble. Because... Actually, Welkin, you just died. Beginning retreat. <sighs> so what happened was... The Grenadier hit the Edelweiss with AP down, which meant it couldn't move. And then it had so little health that it was, uh, it got murder wrecked just from. Okay, all right. Do I have ship orders? Of course not. Why would I have ship orders? It's only the final battle of the fucking video game. Okay, so. From here, I can call back Kai. And Minerva. And they'll come back next turn. I kind of still want to do this this turn, though. Which means... I kind of need some fucking dupes. I kind of need... I don't know... Connor? Yeah, I need Connor to trundle his ass over this way and hopefully take out the Grenadier. Or... something. Hey, Connor! No, what genre? Shut up, Connor. I can't believe I'm relying on Connor the fucking writer to fucking help me win this fucking video game. Please kill this guy, Connor. Please be in murder range for something, anything. The Grenadier. Hit and kill. You can't hit or kill the Grenadier. You might be able to hit this this shock trooper. You'll have to go. He ducked. Okay. All right. You're close. Listen, you're close, and that's something. Right. Right. I just don't get my work. Why is your defense down? Why? Why is that a thing, Connor? Okay, hit the Grenadier. Just hit the Grenadier. Go. Just hit and kill the Grenadier. Okay. All right. I need inspiration. All allies have been it's taken amazing out. that you have an extra action. The problem is you don't have any more ammo. Please, so... Wallace, the fight. You know... All right. Just, just trundle up here, and you know what? You are down a skosh of hit points, so... No, no, Connor. Here, ragnate yourself. Good job, buddy. Okay. So. We're okay. We're making progress. What we're gonna do is we're gonna have... Rita come fill up Connor's ammo and maybe get lucky and kill this shock trooper. Because she's got a long-range weapon. It's conceivable. If we do that, then I can have Connor grenade this shock trooper. Connor grenade this shock trooper. Lily kill this scout, and Lily take the base. And we can do all of those things this turn. And then next turn, there will be no more enemies on the field except the tank, and we can start seriously dealing with the tank. I don't have any actual plan for dealing with the tank yet, but we're gonna get there, maybe. If, of course, if, of course, Rita can help us out. Rita, from right where you are, it would take three headshots to kill that shock trooper. It's not that I don't trust you to do that, but I want you to go uh, go make sure Connor gets his ammo first. That's actually more important. Okay, now. Three headshots. Kill the shock trooper. Pretty, pretty please. <laughs> Fucking perfect! There's one down. That was oh, wonderful. Rita, you're my favorite Rita. Done. Okay, good work. Great. Now, Connor trundles forward, kills the shock trooper. Connor trundles forward, kills the shock trooper. Lily charges forward, kills the scout. Let's make this happen. Now, what genre? 
Murder. Murder, he wrote. Or at least thought about with a grenade launcher in his face. Captain Wallace, I'm behind you all the way. All right. Nope. Hit the trooper, please. There. Thank you. Okay, now. Uh, do you know the shock trooper exists? Can I convince you that shock trooper exists? Exploration strikes. Let's find out. Oh, good. Well, not great, but you know what? It's at least gonna get the shock trooper up and Lily can deal with it. You'll have to go. Good enough. There was always a spare command point in there where Lily wasn't actively killing anything. Let's uh, make that this one. Gotcha. Okay, so Lily gets out of here. Lily's gonna charge that scout. You know, if I want to have a shot. Uh, don't duck, okay? Thank you. Not their lucky day. Oh, see, the problem is now that shock trooper sees you, so this could be bad for you. Roger. You'll be fine, probably. The enemy has begun their You're fine. Let's see what fate has in Anti personnel store. up. That's okay. Okay. Amazing. Astonishing. Flame throw this man's feet to death. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Let's make this happen. Don't retreat. Get over here and crouch. You can just barely crouch. Great turn. Amazing. Okay. We're doing this, sort of. There are no enemies left on the map other than that tank. We keep shooting the same spot. He hasn't noticed that he has a shot at Isari yet, so maybe he just doesn't want to take him. Sorry, by the way, if you want to start grenading that thing to death, I would really appreciate it. All right. Okay. What in the name of unholy God are we going to do to actually hurt this tank, though? Is the question. Like... What turn is it? Is it turn, like, seven? I think it's turn, like, seven. turn five okay all right that's better than it being turn seven okay so i want i want a lord to go heal the hoffen i want the hoffen to start peeling away parts of this thing right i think that's what i want Is that what I want? What else could I want? I've got Kai and Minerva back. They don't really seem actively capable of doing anything. Um. Whoosh. Okay. Got a Lancer there. This Lancer doesn't really do anything at this point, but it's not worth, uh, unless I need someone else on the field, it's not worth getting orange off the field. So let's not worry about that. I guess the thing to do for now is to move the Hoffen down to here, have it take some pot shots over this way, and make sure that a Lark gets there to heal it, just so that it doesn't get wrecked on Lofius is next to turn. All right. Okay, moving out. Now, the issue I'm seeing here, of course, is... Oh my god, that's a ridge. Oh my god, that's a fucking ridge. I've wasted all this movement. I'm working on it and doing poorly. All right. So we have to get down and around, obviously. Okay, moving out. Because I'm bad at navigation. AP up! Do everything. Turn, turn, turn. There is a Hoffen. Turn, turn, turn. What do we have here? We've got the right front radiator. We've got the right front radiator. Got the right middle turret. That's a decent shot. You've got the right front turret. Fuck it. Take it. Fire! Good. You are fairly close to the to the magic death circle. Let's not bring you any closer, shall we? Jimmy. Let's all get a drink after this. Would you be so kind as to advance forward and just find something you like to shoot and shoot at it? All right. What about uh? What about that same thing, Claude Shot? Can you hit that? Too slow. No, you can't. Okay. Well, that's understandable. Do I want you to take another shot from where you are? Absolutely not. I'm going to have everyone who's not super essential right now just kind of not be here for a minute. Because I feel like we need more Lancers than I currently have Lancers. So... Even this Lancer here. Junkie, no from work. 
Even this Lancer here is in a really bad spot for a Lancer. Uh, get off the board. And Millennia, get off the board. And Lily, no, not Lily. Lily gives me a command point. Never mind. Um, that might be it, actually. Because I've got Lancer, Lancer. All right. Uh, from here, give me Warrant. Are these Grenadiers any use to me? Because if those Grenadiers aren't any use to me, I can call in one extra Lancer. But let's not put all of our ducks in a row just yet, or all of our eggs in a basket, or one analogy after another. Let's bring back Hannah. Got five more command points. I'm going to spend one of them having a Lard come up here and heal the Hoffen, and then we're going to call turn. Give it to me. Let's see if we can make that. Let's see if we learn anything this turn. Thank you. I think I might have him in a cycle. The Azure Light is mine and mine alone. You. Yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. All units attack. That's great. Do your turrets count as units? They absolutely do. Disappear. There goes your boom cannon. Be gone. Doesn't actually hit anything. Now you run forward. Are you going to take a pot shot at Jimmy while you're here? Would be annoying, but not the end of the world. Well, your AT cannon took a pot shot at the Hoffen, which is annoying, but not the end of the world. And now you're going to voosh into the water. Okay. I, I kind of don't fear you in the water anymore, buddy, because I know where you're coming out. So you go in the water, you go down there, you come right back out in the same goddamn place. Uh-huh. And there you are. And then you put out your circle. And now you're gonna be like, ooh, look at me, I'm taking pot shots at Jimmy the Lancer. Oh. We're taking major damage. Took a pot shot at the Hoffen. Okay. All right. Well, that's another thing you can do. Um. But that's it, huh? That's what you got. That appears to be what you got. All right. Well. Listen, friendo. I've got a Hoffen. My Hoffen's got legs, sort of. What if my Hoffen ran over here, positioned itself with uh, much better access at all of your uh, fuck shit, just wrecked all of your fuck shit? What then? Hmm? Like, oh no, Death Circle. Uh, what if I just drive right through it? What if I don't pay it any mind, actually? For a second I thought I got stuck, but no, I just ran out of tank legs, which is fine. What if, kaboom. Fire! What then? Right uh, now this is a little too close for comfort, so let's move the Hoffen. Okay, moving out. You're being targeted. The enemy has another counter attack. You there. The Stop doing that. I see. Fire! Okay. Hey, I have an idea. This is an order. Blast those tanks with everything you've got. It's not so much that he talks to the wind as the wind talks to him. Or he interprets it as speech or something. But yes, it is a tank sub with a spike on it. Okay, moving out. It's a true fact. It looks vaguely like a frog, which is neat. Uh, even with a demo boost, that only does two. So I don't think a demo boost actually matters for you. Which is fucking annoying when you put it like that. But, you know, one problem at a time. There goes this AT cannon. Fire! Kaboosh. There goes, well, here's a shot at this turret. Right and Hoffman, unfortunately, is out of ammo, but I do have a lard and plenty of command points with which to use a lard. What is the tank? It's tough as a tank. So, let's just run this way, not get shot to death by turrets, and heal the Hoffman. Vehicle repair kit for the Hoffman. Also, you definitely have to deal with the Hoffman. Okay, so... Uh, Jimmy, you might as well get over here too, right? Let's all get a drink after this. 
Like, is this just gonna be Claude Ward and Jimmy taking out the big boss tank? Because has it always spawns in the same place? I'm kind of okay with Claude Ward and Jimmy taking on the uh, the big boss tank. Uh, that's Lofius, that's Radiator, that's Middle Turret, that's Middle Turret. Isn't there a turret over here that's been hit somehow? Like uh, that one? Yeah, that one. Hey! Good shot, Jimmy the Lancer! Big fan of you! Let's all get a drink after this. Do it again! Jimmy, don't get dead. Go Alright, now this thing gets dead. Great. Uh, Jimmy the Lancer hides behind the Hoffin with a lard. This is fine. I mean, I've got five command points, and I could figure out how to do stuff this turn, but everybody's already moved, and I think I'm in a perfectly safe spot. So... Now, there is the small matter of all of this, but we can deal with that eventually. Like, eventually we can, we can position people here-ish, in also ultra-safe zones, or better yet, all the way the fuck over here. So, I mean, I guess I could... But there's no real point in there's no real point in putting people in danger. Like having I don't know if, if I had the Edelweiss still, right? I could have the Edelweiss come over here and then Rita and Laurent and basically create the same situation. But why would I do that now? Doesn't make sense to do that now. It is only turn seven. I've got 13 more turns. Okay, if this is gonna go bad, it's gonna go bad right now. If I'm missing something, we're gonna find out what I'm missing right now. What I am missing appears to be just fucking nothing, actually. Because the tank goes under the water. Yeah, the tank goes back in the water. Very long tank go in the water cutscene. Tank slides right back out where it came in because it's the only place the tank can go. So, tank comes back up where it is. Tank's gonna take like one shot at the Adel at the at the Hoffin, maybe. Yep, death circle right in the same place. Disappear. Lord, why do you have such a clear shot of that tank? Oh! Oh, he has a mortar. This went bad. Oh. Well, that'll do it. He's got a mortar. All right. I mean, that's annoying. It's not the end of the world. But it is annoying. So. So for right now, where's my other engineer? Oh, there she is. So Rita, if you run this way, and then Minerva and friends grab you, you can, you can get up here and set up a ladder, right? And once you're up here and you've set up a ladder, we can talk about other potentials? Huh. Okay. Jimmy didn't particularly care for getting uh, mortared to death. Is there a thing here that shoots your, your mortar, or is that just a, no, that's just a thing you can do. Okay. Awesome. Great. Great, 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 great. So... Well, we need to rescue a lord. That's just a thing that needs to happen. Also, uh, turns out the tank, uh, Okay, so the game slightly repositions you when you're in here. You should not actually be in this area. Got it. It's annoying, but okay. I won't let you die. Thank you, Karen. So, our best friend, the Hoffman here, can take some pot shots at... Uh, nothing in particular, really. Interesting. Can you get on the side of the, uh... I mean, sort of. Uh, that's a turret right there that only... Yeah, that's not actually gonna work, because you're not... Okay, you're too far away from the... Mm. Alright, well... Listen, one thing at a time. One, uh... One thing at a... The Hoffman, are you too close to do damage to anything? Oh, I had the... I have a fucking machine gun selected. Well, there's a problem. Turns out it's bad to shoot things with a fucking machine gun when you could be shooting them with a fucking tank gun! Well, now we know. No one, of course, being half the battle. Do not show them you're going to point the Hoffman. That will end for Okay, so. I believe the Hoffman can just kind of stand right here and take some shots for a while. Good. Do it again. Do it again, but more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do it again. Great. Down goes an AT cannon. You still got a turret, but it's a detail. We're working on it. Here's a turret. There goes a turret. Come back in here. There goes a turret. Great work. Big fan of you. 
All right, um, good work, the Hoffman. Now, let's worry about this. We've got, uh, well, Jimmy the Lancer's still over here. Jimmy the Lancer probably should not be where he is, come to think of it. But, uh, we'll worry about Jimmy the Lancer in a minute. For now, I want to get Rita heading into this way direction, because Rita's going to need to heal up the Hoffman and then fucking bail, actually. Yeah, Rita, I just want you to charge directly into the most powerful enemy we've encountered in the entire game. I think that'll be fine. I think that's going to go well for you. I think you should do that. I further think that it would be super keen and swell horrific if you could get to the Hoffman in one go. No? All right, fine. We tried. Now, is there any chance that you might be able to thread this needle right here? Why, yes, indeed you can. Astonishing. I love that for me. I also love you repairing the Hoffman. Thank you. Now... Rita, you may remember last Please, turn where we, you know, parked an engineer right the fuck next to the Hoffen, also next to an iceberg, and we counted on the on the Hoffen being out of the way when the when the enemy tank spawned, and what happened was the enemy tank mortared our engineer to death, and our engineer is uh, is currently being patched and mended by Karen. Um, don't worry about that. I'm sure it won't happen a, a, a second time. You're going to be, um, fine? Question mark? Let's go with you're going to be fine. Uh, Jimmy the Lancer, can you take some, uh, go take, more, take a few more pot shots at, at this buddy up here, please? The gun, Is there anyone here who has the ability to shoot you? Uh, there's a right middle turret up there, you know what? That right middle turret only not exists anymore. Yeah, Jimmy, it doesn't matter if that's a non-lethal attack. That was the first one. It's the second one that needs to be lethal, you say. So, like, make it lethal, maybe? Uh, there it is. Please don't miss. Fire! I did say please. Jimmy, I specifically asked you not to miss. Jimmy, I feel really... I really feel like I asked you not to miss and you still missed. And... Look, I don't want to tell you how to do your job or anything, but when a person makes a polite request like that, it's generally considered good form to not fucking miss! But I digress. I'm kind of afraid of bad things happening, but I have an idea. We're gonna take Minerva. Follow my lead. And Laurent. Fall in. Got you covered. They're gonna run this way. Carry off your orders. This is all gonna be fine. The will not fall here. Definitely not gonna get dead. If that thing explodes, it's all over. Like... Okay. Now, Laurent. I'm not scared of anything. Oh, you probably should be, but say, where's that other um? Make sure that the wounded are kept warm. Ah, it doesn't matter. Here, can you just take some, some easy shots at, uh, well, any of these turrets, maybe? Fire! Thank you. I appreciate that. All right. Uh, I've got five more command points. A demo booth? No. Give it to me. Keep going, Warrant. What's that? I need you to actually hit those shots, buddy. I really need you to actually hit those shots when I tell you to shoot I'm them. Scared of anything. Do better this time. Eat this! Hey, you did better that time! Okay. Here. I want you to crash directly in front of the mirror. Pre present this. yourself as a human fucking shield. Okay. So, I think I'm gonna wait. Yeah, I'm just gonna punt. We'll send those. We'll, we'll keep those command points for next turn. The is mine, is mine alone. There's your attack up. Oh, again, oh, you have an emergency heal for what? Disappear. What did you heal? You don't appear to have regenerated your turrets. So maybe one of them was damaged and I didn't kill it. It's entirely possible that one of them was damaged and I didn't kill it, and now it's not damaged anymore. That would be generally speaking fine. Okay. So tank is gonna go go to tank stuff. Oh God. This battle is long and frustrating and not especially interesting right now. Like, I'm probably I'm probably playing it way too conservatively, but I don't sense any massive immediate danger as long as I avoid the obvious pitfalls. And well, the good thing about obvious pitfalls is they're fairly obvious. The bad thing is, the game has once again moved to the Hoffen, so now my engineer is out in the open. And if I had a nickel for every time that happened, I would have two nickels. Which isn't a lot, but it's weird that it happened twice. Still. Alright. Player phase. The Hoffen. Let's figure out how to fucking win this fucking battle, shall we? Okay, moving on. The Hoffen. I'm sorry, there are I know it's no turrets on this side, except the middle one, right? Okay. Wait, 
Well, if that thing explodes, it's all over. Let's take a shot at this middle turret. Right there! Good work. Now, I've got an engineer right here. <laughs> Game wants me to get an engineer directly adjacent to the fucking tank. I'll help you! Let's do this! Okay. Here's a ladder. Escort team, report your status. That seems to be a bad idea. What if we chuck a grenade in there? Game, do we just chuck a grenade in there? Apparently we just chuck a grenade in there. Huh? Rita, don't kill yourself. Chucking a grenade in there has done precisely dick. If the cold doesn't get you, I will. So apparently we need to get a Lancer up there. Which is fine. We have plenty of those. Rita, I need you to be not where you are. I'll drink really help. Okay. So. Well, the good news is, Jimmy the Lancer's a Lancer. Let's all get a drink after this. There are only two turrets that can take pot shots at Jimmy the Lancer as he lances his way up over here. Here we go, a lancening. Stick to the plan. Captain Wallace! All right, now. Glowing weak point, I guess. It's over. Okay. I will not let you interfere. No more. Something new has happened. Do you have any idea how long Albert and I have waited for this moment? Do you have any idea how much more badass you sound when you refer to your dead friend as Albert? I know you were close or whatever, but every time you call him Al, I die a little inside. We shall spark a scientific revolution to take the world by storm. Okay. The promises we made, the dreams we shared, they're finally coming true. I don't believe you. Oh, if only Albert could see this, he should be here with me. Well, he's not, he's dead. Why did you do it, Al? For all I know, you killed him. Why did you deny me? Okay, now we're gonna reveal that you killed him, okay. Okay, good, good, good. Enemy reinforcements have motherfucking fucked. Too easy. They might be soldiers after all. Jimmy, get out, don't get, oh fuck. Oh, you son of a. Okay, 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 okay. It's a grenadier and a scout and a shock trooper. Fortunately, the Hoffen is right the fuck here. All right, so the Hoffman. Are you gonna have, by the way? Bloody pal, are you gonna have? Oh, this poor dead scout. That poor, exceedingly dead scout. Okay. Um, I need you to not be where you are, the Hoffman. You're in the worst place. That might be okay. I think that's okay. So Rita can kill the Grenadier, because the Grenadier is standing now. The Grenadier got knocked out of position. So Rita can kill the Grenadier, run over here, climb the ladder, fill up Jimmy's ammo, and get the fuck out of there. Right? Right? You can do all of those things? I better, you better be able to do all of those things. Start with... Don't duck. Great. Didn't duck. Target eliminated. Keep up the good work. Get over here. Climb up. Ammo for Jimmy. You can't now. climb down. Don't you go- Oh, God! Can, uh, can I get Lauren and Rita back, please? <sighs> Thank you. Okay. All right. So, James. I'll hold them off. Get that soon, you know. All the radiators closed. Here, I got another one. 
Reporting. Super. Give me your travel to get off the tank. Because the thing, yep, the thing closed. Okay, so you can only kill one at a time. You can't climb down because the tank's in the bottom. Go. Okay, all right. It's okay. Still got command points. The Hoffman's still got a little bit of legs. It's okay. <laughs> We're only sort of fucked. Okay. Great. Now, there is absolutely nothing here for you to shoot. Okay. That's fine. End your turn. Don't care. Five more command points. That means Jimmy the Lancer gets down, runs as far away as he can, and heals. Let's all get a drink after this. We're gonna be a soon, you know? Jimmy the Lancer gets down, hides behind this ice rock. Good enough. And heals. Good, 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 good. Now, that's something. There's still the small matter of this shock trooper, who I don't like. What I can do is have Minerva come over here I can have Minerva bring Laurent over here and kill this Shock Trooper. Then I can have Laurent finish off the right middle turret. That actually sounds like a good idea. Follow my lead. Hold in. Laurent, you're with me. If this is where I die, Don't mind me crossing in front of the tank. Just crossing in front of the fucking tank. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what, fucker? I don't care. You're dead. Good work, Minerva. Uh, I need you to leave Lawrence here and start booking it in this way direction, shall we? Because you're in a really, 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 really bad spot, actually. And I want you to be in an ever so slightly less bad spot. Yeah, this is still a bad spot, actually. Get further away. Moving out. Please. Now. Immediately. For the love of God. Just keep running. You've got such incredible scout legs. Just get the fuck away from absolutely everything and also heal yourself. Good turn, Minerva. Okay. Good. Now. I have two more command points and one more thing I want to do. Laurent! I'm not scared of anything. I don't... Oh, just quote that. Um, can you... Can you see the middle turret at all? Have I wasted this point? I have not wasted this point. Good. Just don't miss, okay? Great! Awesome. Now hide behind the crystal. Don't get dead. Okay. Good. Now, next turn. Uh, Alard and Rita are going to spawn from over here. That's going to be fine. They're going to run this way and they're going to put up a ladder here and Laurent is going to come over here and we're going to win the fucking game. Sort of. Turn nine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Poor dead Al. Blow up the same thing you always blow up, why don't you? Bang poll in the chat, by the way, to choose our new Thursday game while we're watching the same thing. This is the finale of Valkyria Chronicles 4. Next Thursday, we'll be playing something new. Ordinarily, when not much of interest is happening in combat, I fast forward it on YouTube. I might just start skipping these or like doing them at four times speed or something because man, this is a very long segment of no gameplay and no changes. How dare you defy Alan B? Yeah, yeah. Alan B, oh no. Take one shot at the Hoffman. We're taking major damage. Yeah, I know. I'll get an engineer there eventually. Okay. Allied reinforcements have arrived. Hooray. Great green gobs of motherfucking ducking shit. Okay. Alard, go to the Hoffman. What is the take? Over there. Man, I want to do some repairs. Do some repairs. That's literally what I'm asking you to do. Hold position. I'll head over for support. We have the fun. Can you get there in one shot, maybe? Uh, no. No, you cannot. Okay. All right. Well, listen. What does it take? We need you to do multiple things anyway, now that I think of it. First of all, repair the often. Thank you. Second of all, place a ladder over here. Oh, there's a ladder over there. Oh, so awesome. The ladders just hang on? Those are good ladders. All right, ammo for Jimmy. Um, oh, you've already acted this turn. All right, um... Hey, just stand here with Jimmy. I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm sure that won't be terrifyingly awful or anything for anyone. No, sorry, Bob. Why would you think that? Who could possibly think that? <sighs> Lily, can you, like... Lily, I want you to grab Connor and run down this way, would you? He knows what'll happen. <laughs> this is a nice spot. <laughs> Alright, so for all the good that did, we've got Connor a little bit closer. I'm gonna... We're, we're gonna run someone up here, and we're gonna drop another... Yeah, we're gonna hit one of these things again. Hold on. Go wrong. What indeed could go wrong? Jimmy the fucking Lancer. Climb up. Don't get wrecked. Right here. Dude, dude. What do you mean two? What do you mean two? Seriously? Two? Oh, shock and horror. The worst thing in the history of the world is going to take two shots. Now, go wrong. Kaboom. Please don't summon more dudes. I remember that day in that backwater Gallian sweatshop you called a factory. I offered you my hand. But you brushed it aside. You said you'd never join the Empire. Mm-hmm. Then you twisted the knife and told me you had no intention of finishing our studies. 
Why did I go? I groveled at the feet of those pompous Imperials to rise through the ranks. And for what? It was all for you. To create the perfect environment for us to complete our research. We wouldn't have had to worry about funding, or deadlines, or red tape, or ethics. I set the stage for us, and waited for you to join me. It's awful nice of you to confess to murdering Riley's dad after we've explicitly taken Riley off the map. So, so she can't even react to the fact that you murdered her dad. Uh, there's another shock trooper here. Should probably send someone to kill him. Hey, Claude, can you do that? Busy. Appreciate it. Look out, they're on to you. Yeah, buddy, you're really? All right, well, maybe I'll hit your skull anyway. How many, uh, how many machine gun shots to the skull would it take to murder you? Two. Oh, well, in that case. Right there! You're dead. They might be soldiers after all. How about that? Good work, comma, the Hoffen. And roll back. Good job. For the dude. Interesting. Uh, Grenadier right here. Don't like that. Scout over here. Not really a fan. Uh, Lard. Hey, Lard's gotta be over on that side anyway, right? Seems a little risky, but whatever. Where's the tank? It's right in front of you. It's the big thing. Kind of smoking. Vaguely on fire. Remember? Anyway. Ah! Oh, you're too close to the... Oh, okay. That's bad. Now's my chance! Should be much closer to the uh oh well there are southern riders to place Looks like that. Used to snow oh that's bad Leave it to me. <laughs> okay all right great work of lard okay. see the thing is you're out of legs so i guess you're gone buddy cool now, if there are rare turrets that need to be detonated, and we have Lawrence the Lancy person, why don't we have uh, Lawrence the Lancy person do a little bit of uh, turret detonating, shall we? Seems imminently reasonable, right? Give it to me! Lawrence, you only have one shot. Well, don't miss your chance to blow, then. This opportunity comes once in a lifetime. There you go. All right, we get out of fire. Okay, um, now, Minerva hasn't acted this turn. Has anyone brought anyone anywhere this turn? Was that this turn? That was this turn that Lily grabbed Connor and ran this way. So there's nobody left to, uh, okay. Um, you know, I still have, I have another command point. I'm going to uh, summon a large just in case things go horribly, horribly wrong. And I'm also going to take Rita and run her down this way and see if maybe I can uh, fill up Lauren. I don't think you can get there in one turn. I think that's a bit of a long haul, but you know, you need to not be in the death zone anyway. So yeah, you can definitely get there. I wonder if you might even be able to place that ladder this turn. Is that an idea? You know what that is, an idea. Get over here. Uh, there's a ladder you can place right here. Uh, that'll be all the ladders we place today. This turn, rather. There'll be more in just a moment, but for right now. You might as well heal Laurent. And you might as well call turn. Good job, Rita. End of phase. Huh? Yeah, all never do this when I check out Oh! Jimmy. This doesn't look good. Oh, the uh the rear turret machine gun took a liking to Jimmy. Well, I mean that's bad. Hopefully Rita's still alive. Hey, Rita's still alive, she's got revival ragnate. That's something. Oh, Connor. Connor's trying. Not actually doing anything, but you know. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh shit, if he touches Jimmy the Lancer, is Jimmy just dead? Hold on. That might be bad. Disappear. Damn. Okay. Direct hit. It's a little bit of damage to the Hoffman, that's okay. Just don't um don't touch my Jimmy the Lancer, would ya? Nice. Alright, that got briefly terrifying. So, uh Lawrence here. Um, okay, so Rita, I'm gonna try. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have Lawrence run over here, kill this turret, and then see if he's getting shot by the left one. If he's getting shot by the left one, I'm gonna have him kill the left one too. Give it to me. He's not calling you cute. That's what I want to do. Clear, Claude. You have to end the battle. Fire. Okay. Oh, no, I okay. So what I want is I want Rita to get over here and revive Jimmy. Do you have enough ammunition? 
rather than just medic him. So that's gonna be fine. Looks like it's my turn. Lauren will climb up here and grenade and uh, lance this next uh, eventually. But first, we're gonna do this. We can do this. There's the wind up. Revival Ragnade. I said revival Ragnade. Thank you. Close one. Okay, make sure Jimmy's stopped up on ammo. Get the fuck out of there. Might as well make sure Lauren's stopped up on ammo. Because he's right here. Get the fuck out of there. Good job, Rita. Okay, now. Jimmy takes out the left rear turret, and then we're gonna worry about uh, Lawrence taking out this and having to deal with all these people. What could go wrong? What indeed could go wrong? Aside, of course, from all the things that will inevitably go wrong. Too slow! And you turn, 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 and you turn! I was hitting the wrong button. Just a scratch. I was hitting the wrong button. And because I was hitting the wrong button, Jimmy the Lancer died. Well, not died, but we have to do this again. Unbelievable. Rita. Thank you. What could go wrong? Really? Place the ladder while you're here, would you? Get the fuck out of there while you're here, would you? Okay. Good job, Rita. James and the Giant Lancer, kill this turret. The last fucking turret is now fucking dead. Thank fuck. Jimmy, get the hell out of here. What am I doing? Keep running. Okay, uh, no, Jimmy needs to keep fucking going. Go wrong. Get further away. You'll be fine eventually, but not right now. Now, for the love of God, don't shoot your lance at the hot glowing weak point. Just heal yourself. First aid boost. First aid boost. Good job, Jimmy. Okay, that took a long time. I was afraid for a second. Okay, now. Laurent is gonna blow up this radiator, and we're gonna see what happens next. The power of justice! Justice, eh? Looks like it's my turn. Oh, you're a tank slayer, and that's why your thing goes to one. Good job, Laurent. Eat this! <sighs> but you, Albert Miller, you betrayed me. You abandoned our dreams! It was only logical that you died. Against my wishes, you tried to kill our precious research, our dream! And if that wasn't cruel enough, you told me the Azure Light should never be born! Well... That it wasn't meant to shine on this world! Well... You claim it should not exist for the sake of your daughter and her entire generation! Again! All of this confession happening to no one, with not even Riley present to hear it. On that day, your body died, but your legacy lives on. Just look at that beautiful blue glow. Our research, our hearts and souls made manifest. And also the three enemies I'm about to spawn. Our dream is finally being realized. That's right, Al. This is the light of our creation! The future we dreamed of! Okay. I forgive you for everything. Let's start over. Let's wipe the slate clean. Shall we? Enemy reinforcements have appeared. Oh god, no! Oh my god, it's a shock trooper and a scout and a lance and a grenadier. Well, however, will we do anything? How's it looking out there? Okay, please don't shock troop me to death, Mr. Shock Trooper. I can't actually deal with you right now. The enemy has begun no, the don't attack. shock troop me, bro. I said don't shock troop me, bro. All right, um, I have four command points with which to play. That's going to be... Hmm, should be a question, actually. Um... Connor, Connor, Minerva? I like it. Connor! Right, right. Can you shoot any of them from right here? Nope. Welcome. Connor needs some help. Connor needs some fucking help. Connor needs a lot of fucking help. Alright. Please hit. You've gotta be able to hit a dude. You've gotta be able to hit a dude. You've got to be able to hit a dude. You've just. There's there's a dude you've got okay, hit the dude. Take aim. That wasn't the dude I intended for you to hit, but okay. Extra fucking action! All allies have been taken out! Astonishing. 
Grenadier. There. You tried. You're being targeted. All right. Well. Okay. Right. Right. Put your shit away. Move over this way. Scout there, gonna die. Grenadier here, gonna die. Take aim. Dead. Oh, and if we hit the base of one of those, it goes away. Good to know. All right, two command points, and Connor's out of uh, Connor's out of ammo, so it can't be Connor. Jimmy's out of AP, so it can't be Jimmy. Lauren is kind of out of AP and a Lancer. Reed is kind of out of AP. Um, it could be the Hoffman, actually. Okay, moving out. I've heard worse ideas. Buddy. Buddy, you're a scout. Right there! Captain Wallace! I'm behind you all the way! Good job. Magic history. Okay, Hoffman not in dead zone, Jimmy not to corpse. Turn over. Disappear. On my side. So what exactly was left on this thing to murder? Is there one more on the right side? I think maybe there's one more on the right side. Is there one in the back? Got ladders dripping off your fucking surface. Do I have to go up the front? How do we kill you? Down you go. Into the thing again. You know what's great is that after this, we probably have like 45 minutes of cutscenes and credits. I'm really excited for that. Okay, so there's one more on the right side. Fair enough. Don't kill anybody. Take your pot shot at the Hoffman. Yeah, no, it hurt. Okay. Man, there better not be another face to this. Enemy reinforcements if you're fucking kidding. You're fucking That's a... Well, the good news is this one's a Grenadier, so... I don't actually have to worry about that one. Leave it to me! Unbelievable. And Lauren's potential didn't trigger, so this will take two. Alright, alright. You know what? It's okay. It's okay. I think... Maybe... Just maybe... We're about to beat Valkyria Chronicles 4. Leave it to me. Maybe. I'll crush you. Oh, now you get the boost. Come on. Fire! Oh. Oh, boy. It's quiet. Did we really stop the tank? Apparently so. Oh, don't say that. Yeah. It's thanks to all of you. Now we can go save Angie. Don't say Wait that. Where's Riley? On the Centurion, Claude. That's where you sent her. I can't get through to her. Is she still on the Centurion? I mean, probably. Miles, head for the ship. I know it's dangerous, but please. You got it, Claude. Come what may. I'm ready to follow you to the ends of the earth. Miles, you better confess your love for that man before he kisses Riley, cause, um, you're running out of time. It's another D rank. Listen, we got there. It, 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 it was a fight. I, I don't know what to tell you. Andy. Please tell me it isn't too late. Riley, it took you 45 minutes to run down there, so... I'll save you! Actually, that's 45 minutes if I speed up, like, every section of the video, so... It took you two hours to run down there. So... Lord Belgar... Oh, no. I killed the enemy, Lord Belgar. Who did you kill, Nicola? I did not fail. I'm not like... Yara. Nicola, who did you kill, and why do I think it's the engineer whose name I'm forgetting? You are enemy. I'll kill Lord Belgar's enemies. Mm-hmm. Get out of my way! Oh, hey, she has a pistol. Kill. N now, granted, Nicola's kind of a boss character, so... This might go poorly. I may or may not have gone poorly. Riley. It appears to have gone poorly. We're out of 
have time. Go, go, go! Got it! Did we get the bad ending because I got a D rank on the last mission? That sure would suck. I'm fine. A little pain won't stop me. You got shot in the gut. Okay, well. Angie, I'm coming. Okay. Wait. I have to go. Someone I love needs me. Someone I love. Oh boy. Lord Belgar. Mm. You sure about that though? Lord Belgar. Where are you? Yara. Quite dead. Oh, poor Nicola. Oh, hey, fire. <laughs> Angie! Angie! Seems bad. The Imperials left like this here. It must be forcing the implosion to happen. Doesn't make I sense, but okay. Engineer it. I can stop it. So, so what happened with the first thing? Okay. I can't lose Angie to this. Not to some sick, twisted corruption of Dad's research. Mm hmm. I was such an idiot. I never even considered why Dad refused to give his work up to the Empire. Well, he was making bombs the whole time. I just completed the research and handed it over to the United Goddamn States, no questions asked. A Vinland! I wasn't ready to deal with the consequences. <laughs> I only cared about revenge. <laughs> My blind hatred did this to you, Angie. Yep. Yep, Riley is become death, destroyer of worlds. So I promise I'll rescue you, no matter what. Dad did not invent Ragnite compression to hurt people. I mean... He didn't refine his theories to continue the cycle of hate. Mm. All he wanted was to make people happy. Yeah, but it's the cycle of hate, and it moves us all through despair and mostly despair actually because there's a lot of hate involved that goes for you too angie you were born to be happy i will i will get you out of here I, I think she was boggers. I think uh, up until like the moment the war was technically over, she was all like, yeah, let's blow up the kid. But, you know, then somebody creepier than her was like, yes, let's blow up the kid. And now she, faster? now she doesn't want to do that. Sorry, the road's really bumpy. What road? Riley, answer me. Riley. Claude, you're on an ice Damn field. It. I can't get through. Surrounded by ice fields. You're on an ice field made out of ice fields. What do you mean by road? Riley, are you okay? I got Andy, but I can't quite. You saved her? I mean, she's a tiny Valkyrian I'm child, can't she? Where are you? Engine room's on fire. I can't move. And she's sleeping like an angel. A real life angel. Oh, boy. Riley, hang in there. Mmm, that's great. Okay, well, what, what can we... Uh, I know. Let's talk about Hoffen. Okay, it's big. It's got treads. Very heavily reinforced. Massive glowing weak point. Like, you know, all Hoffen. fucking tanks, but... I don't want to go home. Claude, this was a bad choice. And we will. Really, really soon. You're gonna rebuild that factory, right? Uh-huh. You remembered. I was serious, you know. I've got big plans. Ideas to patent. Nudges to design. 
Tiny Valkyrian children to kill me in nuclear fire. If I can just get the money, I could start any time. God, here I am, burning to death. I'm talking shop. Can we talk about something romantic? Now, Riley, come on. You're not burning to death. You're asphyxiating. We're bleeding out. If you were burning to death, there would be a lot more screaming involved. Uh, sure. How about the Star Child Festival? Yeah, not bad. But we can't get those medals anymore. We're all grown up now. Raz and Kai are gone. We can't turn back the clock. Well, I mean, Kai turned out to be evil, and Raz turned out to be willing to sacrifice himself to stop evil, so... Some parts of you know. childhood you can only appreciate as an adult. Um, well, uh, Kai as in the original the Kai, as in Forsetti, as in our sniper chick's brother, that Kai, yeah, he died. Uh, our Kai shot him, and he bled out and died. But um, our Kai, the sniper, did not die, as far as we know. When we get back, let's make some new memories. Happy ones. Our Kai spent most of the last battle just kind of chilling by an outpost and having her command point be used by other more useful units like Engineers and Jimmy the Lancer. I mean, there was a lot of war and fire and death and blood involved. Riley, we've got so many happy memories to make back in Hoffen. You and me together. Riley? Uh... Riley! Oh no! Claude, you've been running this whole time, right? Because this is a very long conversation. Okay. Tiny Valkyrian child, is it time to wake up? Riley! Are we gonna get a large Riley! Valkyrian savior? I won't run away. Not again. Claude, there's an awful lot of fire happening. Okay. Okay. I guess you... You're a commander, you can grab Angie and Riley and, and, and they can run. Okay, that makes sense. He's got the, oh right, hi, Belgar. The Azure Light is mine and mine alone. Uh-huh. But if I can't have it, no one can. Great. Is this the part where Kai kills you? Lord Belgar. Oh, it's the point where Nicola kills you. That's more poetically satisfying. Oh, Nicola, thank you. God, you came back to me. Did you fail? Mm, don't say yes, because I think failure is a bad word. No, of course not. I have so much left to do. Hurry and help me up. We need to get to the Centurion and... I fail. Uh-oh. Lord Belgar, you... Are a failure. Oh boy. Nonsense. I never fail. Quickly, Nicola. Hmm. I don't think she's, uh. I know. Let's go together. Say what now? <laughs> Good girl. Now, there's no time. Let's hurry. Oh, she's gonna. Don't um... be scared. Lonely hurt for a moment. Well, this is gonna be sad and tragic, but the self-destruct switch. When did you? Mm, boy. No more failures, just like you wanted. No. Oh. Kiara is waiting for us. Come, Lord Belgar. It's kind of really sad that there was never any long-term rehabilitation for Kiara or Nicola, but I guess it's supposed to make us feel that much more satisfied that Belgar is killed by his own creation? Yeah, let's go with that. N Nicola, stop! Don't you dare! I command you! <sighs> yeah, but she doesn't listen to failures. Kabutton. 
Kabutton! The Petard Doth Hoist. Oh, and hey, there goes your tank. And your cane! Your super fancy cane. And also, uh-oh. Um, is that supposed to happen? It's probably not supposed to happen. No. Please, I can't lose them too. Not them too. Please, no. Raz. Brother. Save them. You have to help them. I like how she calls him brother just so the player is not at all confused. Ragnarok? Really? The dog? Okay. They made it out. Okay. Okay. Miles, you gotta ramp it. <laughs> Miles. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, abandoned tank. We gotta get away. Guys, abandoned tank. <laughs> We're trapped here. She's going down. It's only a matter of time. Don't Miles, give up yet. Miles, abandoned tank. No different from what we always do. When things are at their worst, we find a way through. Abandoned tank. That's Squad E. Our friends are always there for us. But we're alone. We're stuck alone on the ship and there's no one left to save us. Cue someone left to save you. Maybe. Possibly. Abandoned tank and run for it. Isn't it? Claude, abandoned tank and run for it. You can... right. We only made it this far because of our friends. Our squad. Their hopes. Their dreams. Their sacrifices. Now it's my turn to be a sacrifice. And that's all there is to it. Probably not. Hey, Raz. Looks like I did get a little stronger. I'm sorry that it... It wasn't strong enough. Hey, you basically won the war. That counts for something, I tried, right? I man. I gave him my best shot. I swear. Abandon tank and run for it! You're so cool, boy. Okay, you're further away now. Took a little less time. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. made us a ramp, basically. Or Welkin. She's, with us. She's telling us to live. Maybe that was Welkin in the Edelweiss. You know. Could be. Clearly wasn't Ronald. He's right there. But... Goodbye, headquarters. Does this mean we have to set up tents again? I think this means we have to set up tents again. Oh boy. Oh. Oh, that cleanup is gonna be a bitch. Rest in peace, Centurion. You were with us until the very end. Our most stalwart friend. And the finest soldier of us all. The evil boat constructed by the Federation for the specific purpose of nuking a city with millions of innocent people. Was our finest friend and the greatest of us all. Also, we only met it like 40% of the way through the game. And, and we had, and we had tanks the whole time. Okay. That's Valkyria Chronicles 4? <laughs> Game, do we not get an epilogue? Hold on. And, and they all saluted the ship as it sank to the bottom of the ocean. The end.
Okay? <laughs> I feel like there might be something I'm missing here, and maybe we get a little bit of um, post-credits clarity at some point, but... Uh... Yeah, it could be an after credit scene. Could be some mid credits flashes here and there of, you know, Claude and Riley going back to Hoffen and rebuilding the city. Kai making peace with her dead brother and dead boyfriend and, I don't know, shacking up with Minerva. That would be nice. Um, in case that was the end of it, <laughs> this is Valkyria Chronicles 4. I liked it a lot. <laughs> I know we spent most of the last, oh, six streams, let's say, just utterly shitting all over the plot, but, you know, it was good. It was fun. I will say, like, I mean, this game was, and I said this for basically the second battle, and it constantly proved itself to be true. The developers of Valkyria Chronicles 4 very clearly took the the lessons learned from the original Valkyria Chronicles and like the general just the general mindset of that game and they made it more all of the complexity all of the strategy all of the fighting all of the all of the mishigas all of the nonsense all of the bullshit that comes with battles in Valkyria Chronicles the makers of Valkyria Chronicles 4 took a look at and were like, yes, we want that, but more. And like chapter four or so had the first really major instance of this super big battle, like the battle at the line, right? The battle at the line was as big and as complicated as any battle in the original Valkyria Chronicles except for like the very final battles. And that was chapter four. This game just kept going and kept hitting it and kept raising the bar over and over and over again. And it just, it kept adding layers and adding complexity and it didn't ever feel, every, almost every level, especially like a major battle in every level had a gimmick or had a thing you had to do that kept the battles feeling fresh. It wasn't just, here's a map, here are some dudes, kill all the dudes and you win. And it instead it was, you know, you have to get to this place. You have to get this character to do a thing. You have to use classes that you don't use. Even in the final battle, the final battle forces the player to use engineers and lancers. And for the most part, over the course of the game, we didn't use engineers, we didn't use lancers. At the same time though, we could have taken grenadiers. We could have specked out an armor attacking grenadier and skipped the whole ladder thing and the whole lancer thing by launching grenades. We could have done it that way. That kind of multifaceted attack just wasn't in the original Valkyria Chronicles. And I think, I think the introduction of the Grenadier unit was really cool. It provided, even though enemy Grenadiers are a pain in the ass to fight, oh my God, enemy Grenadiers are a pain in the ass to fight. Allied Grenadiers are so useful and so versatile. I loved the introduction of the leader mechanic where you're able to grab like form a little convoy of units and be like yeah let's all go crush this thing that was really cool i know i never used the apc but i'm sure like the apc is a really cool addition you can play the game with that and that's totally fine that's great i just there are so many things you can do in this game. Each battle is its own thing. Again, I love the mechanics of this game. I absolutely adore the mechanics of Valkyria Chronicles, and I would love it if somebody, anybody, steal these fucking mechanics. I love the, the tactical map-based combat going into first person, or not even first person, but going into third person where you're actually controlling an individual unit. 
it's really cool and it's something I only really see in Valkyria Chronicles. So I would love it if there were more games that did that or something like it. You know, give me a Fire Emblem that plays like this. Give me a Mass Effect that plays like Valkyria Chronicles. And that would just be over the moon, mechanically. Uh, by the way, Crimea is sad. Vols is not worried about... Oh, hi, Fenrir. Hi, Fenrir. It's a good puppy. It's a good puppy. They'll snuggle eventually. She is indeed Crimea because she's so sad. So yeah, mechanically, I, again, I love the, st the strategy and the tactics of looking at the battle map and then being like actually moving a piece. And when you move a piece on the map, you control that unit and it's an actual person with an actual personality and actual like bonuses and stats and their own individual unit things. I love that. I love that so fucking much. Again, give me, give me a game set in the Mass Effect universe like that. Give me just any tactical war game set like that. I will eat that shit up for breakfast. Oh, Angie's a sad. Why is Angie a sad Angie? Kai, was your plan to just leave Angie alone in the graveyard? And you're only just now making the decision to have her come with you? Because... Okay. That would be weird. Also, I can't help but notice that our final shot of Kai in the game is from the back. Anyway, um... The doggy is wearing a hat, and I love it. We never got any explanation for the dog. They just have a dog. I I like the dog. I'm a fan of Ragnarok. He's a very cute puppy. We never met the dog. He was just there. He was just always there. There were flashback chapters where the dog was always there. Ah, oh, this... And again, it's Valkyria Chronicles. The art style is gorgeous. Again, really unique to this series. I don't see anything very, very like it. Again, I know we shat on the plot of this game. And the plot of this game is a Valkyria Chronicles-ass plot of a video game. But, god damn. God damn, this is a good video game. God damn, this is a good video game. When we first set out, all we really knew was that we had something worth fighting for. None of us could have foreseen what the fight would cost us. And maybe... Maybe we'll never know if it changed us for the better. But in the end... Through all the hope... All the tragedy... Oh, poor dead crystal. The things I hold on to... Are the memories of my friends. Of their smiles. It was a battlefield, but it was where we grew up. Except for Zyga, he died. We don't mention Zyga, but he also died. With the unexpected announcement of a ceasefire, the Second European War came to an abrupt end. Leaving soldiers and civilians alike to count the Eastern Theater's almost unfathomable losses. A death toll numbering over 10 million. That's a lot. It had been a global war, a conflict beyond anything the world had ever faced. 
Historians speculate that the ceasefire saved Europa from a cataclysmic drop in population. Yeah, you can survive 10 million, but not like 12. Yet the truth of Operation Cygnus and of the Valkyria themselves was swiftly hidden from the public eye. Federation of the bad guys, and remember? so this story of those who crossed the frozen sea passed into history untold. Mm-hmm. Well, that's a shame. <laughs> Decorated members of Squad E. Okay. Uh, Zyga, dead. Everyone else alive. I will say, I feel good. I did not commit. I did not guarantee that this was going to be a no deaths run. At the same time, okay, Crystal died, but that was storyline. That was storyline. The plot killed Crystal. My hands are clean. The plot killed Zyga. My hands are clean. There were many times where the the Hoffman blew up or the Edelweiss blew up or Riley got incapacitated or Kai got incapacitated, but nobody died. Nobody died. Very important. Hey, thanks for watching the video. Be sure to subscribe and hit the bell so you don't miss an upload. And if you want to catch the streams live, go to twitch.tv slash the underscore goog. The stream schedule's on screen now.